And breaking now, I-275 eastbound is shut down because of a deadly crash. This happening at Kellogg Avenue. Our Chancellor Wynn just got there and he joins us with the very latest. Chancellor, what do you know? What do you see? Rob, what we do have confirmed is that one person is dead and there are multiple other injuries. As you can see behind me, we are here at exit 71. That's where the eastbound lanes of Interstate 275 are closed. As you can see, the sheriff deputy car right there blocking traffic. But the accident is actually closer to exit 69, which is going to be five mile road. And this all unfolding around 930. So we are still very early on trying to get updates here as well. As you can imagine, because of the Interstate 275 eastbound lanes are closed, that is backing up traffic quite a bit, but it does allow you to get across the bridge. But officers are detouring people here on exit 71. But again, that accident is about two miles down the road. We do know over we did hear lots of responding officers and ambulances from here in Hamilton County. And of course, we are still working to learn more details about the extent of the injuries. But what we know right now and what we have confirmed is that at least one person is dead. Multiple people are injured, and this is all unfolding because of an overturned truck on Interstate 70, 275. Of course, we're going to continue to follow this and bring you more updates, but for right now, Interstate 275 eastbound lanes are completely closed starting here at exit 71 because of that deadly car accident that happened closer to exit 69. For now, reporting live in Hamilton County, Chancellor Wynn, Fox 19 Now. And, and so, Chancellor, just one quick question if you can hear me. So people know the accident is two miles east of where you are. Is this before or after the Combs Hale Bridge? Yeah, Rob, this is east of that bridge that you're speaking of. And again, it is two miles further down, further east. So we're at exit 71, and the accident is closer to exit 69. But again, it is east side of that bridge. All right, that sounds good. And so they're forcing people off there uh, where Chancellor is, and the exit, it's closer to Anderson Township. So this is the part of I-275 after you pass over the Combs Hill Bridge as you approach Anderson Township. Chancellor Wynn will keep watching this scene for us and bring us updates as they come in.